back at the storage unit, gonna pull, I think, what, 20 orders? And we are back from vacation, back from time away mode, and what we did, and it worked. All these orders were in one day that you're about ready to see. I think it was 20 orders or 25 orders in one day, $650, I think, in gross amount of sales. Came back, actually, we didn't list anything yet. We haven't listed anything. We have been packing a lot. I think when we came back, we had 20 some items, and we have another 20 some items, which is super good. But we did come back, immediately put the, sa the store on sale for 15% off, been sending offers, and then we also promoted everything in the store which wasn't promoted before about half was promoted for trending so that's what we did and it worked out incredibly well again 650 dollars in one day we'll take that all day long the first thing that's sold is going to be a book dude perfect i think we picked this up at for two dollars at a yard sale so for ten dollars plus shipping all right the other day i bought and these sold super fast uh, i bought 30 pounds of legos at a yard sale for 20 dollars. i actually sold the minifigs for 20 bucks so everything else has been profit this guy actually had bought one just one uh flat rate box and what i did was i just kind of sectioned them up threw them in flat rate boxes large flat rates and one was uh, eight and a half pounds one was nine pounds and he bought both of them $72 in the profit here and then plus shipping on that so super easy I'm telling you now I don't know if I ever come across 30 pounds of Legos again but if I do definitely gonna pick them up and uh, that's a really good profit and super super easy all right let's go over some cookware this is becoming one of my favorite things to sell we just found one of these in Baltimore Maryland and it is the Revereware copper bottom, but it has the insert for the egg poacher. And I'll go ahead and flash it up what it looks like. And uh, these things, man, pick them up for seven. I think this we actually picked up for two bucks. One in Baltimore we picked up for seven. So for $43 plus shipping, easy sale there. Sell through rate, super good on those. So right here, this is a viewer sale. Thanks again for Justin. You blew up our store once again. I think he bought 10 items or eight items. This is one of the items you bought for $5 plus shipping. Thank you so much. And then also the Corningware three and a half quart amber cooking ovenware right here. Uh, this sold for twenty six dollars plus shipping. The reason I picked it up is because it is a bigger one, and um, I've never seen one this size before. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> Keeping that in. Anyway, so this sold for twenty six dollars plus shipping. C eighteen. We have sold a very nice. Starbucks cup. I think you picked this up for only a dollar. Mm -hmm. Was it dollar? So for 16 plus shipping. It's funny because actually when you look these up, you were saying that they weren't worth worth that much. But um the top. The top is what made it worth the most. Is that the top, this one has this nice ceramic, I guess it would be called ceramic top. Yeah. A lot of them are missing it. So if it has this top, definitely make sure you comp it out correctly because the top itself I think is worth like 10 bucks. We sold a Muppets Christmas movie. Debbie bought this for her kids, and we appreciate your buy. Thank you. Also, check out Kayla's shirt right here. Cuddly as a grenade, and as you can tell, I'm wearing the same one. We got matching shirts. These are the ones that we did 20 cents a piece on at the yard sale, and actually, we're already in the profit on these. People were saying they're going to take forever, and I was never going to get five bucks a piece, and I said I was going to. Six dollars and 75 cents plus shipping on this one. And uh, like I always say, if, if the comps are there, buy it and sell it on eBay. All right, a C9. $15 and 30 cents. Like I always say, look out for little wrenches like this. This is a Craftsman. It is a quarter inch drive V series forged in the United States. Little ratchet works perfectly fine. $15 and 30 cents. You can't get any easier than this. And this thing only a quarter in the same bin right here. Again, tools, $12 and 75 cents for this snap on impact. Always talk about snap on impacts half inch drive right here. Um, always good. Again, snap on great brand to resell. Probably only got about a quarter to 50 cents into this. In the hat bin right here, we sold the Panama Jack fishing hat. Really good condition. This is pre-owned though. Got it for a dollar. Sold for $10 and 50 cents plus shipping. Panama Jack right there. And these are nice because they have the little drawstring in the back that kind of fits it to your head. So definitely a good buy there with the Panama Jack. And somebody please pay the electric bill. Boop. All right, another viewer sale for Justin. A really nice Xbox. Gave you a really good deal on this. Only 40 bucks heading your way. Everything. If you do buy multiple stuff from us, we do combine shipping. But right here, that's not bad, Justin. It's 
going to you. All right, and then we saw this Campbell's tomato soup to Justin as well. Like Julian said, we appreciate everything that you bought in our store. Six, C6, where are you at? C6. And another thing for Justin is going to be this thing right here. That's not it. Just kidding, Justin, this is not yours. Yours is blue. Found it. It's a cute little Mario Kart Wii pencil container. What is in this one, lead weights? What is in here? Oh, I think this sold too, the coach. Pretty sure. Yes. Um, yep, there it is. Whew. All right, another Justin buy. Thank you so much. It's heading your way. It's a little statue, and I actually had the same one on one of my shelves that says bald and beautiful, and these are kind of funny. These actually we got for free. This is a genuine coach dust cover for the purse. Somebody said actually that we couldn't sell these on eBay, that they would take them off. We didn't get any taken off. We sold it for $7.82, got it for free, because we bought the coach bag and three of these were inside of it. We got a plush. This is our plush bin. And I'm hoping he is in here. He's very small. He's probably hiding at the bottom somewhere. Found him. Little Bendy. He went for $18 plus shipping. And and uh, we probably picked him up for about $0.25 cents or a dollar at a yard sale. Um, or we could have bought him at a, uh, a thrift store for a dollar. So definitely a good profit there. All right. In C8, 5M, we got skews on skews here. Precious Moments, Hawthorns, $10.75. Got these for, we're well in the profit here when it comes to these Hawthorne things. Precious Moments, Hawthorne Christmas figurines. Be on the lookout. Bolo for these, big time money. This thing's pretty cool. We got this for $2 at a yard sale. Went for $15 plus shipping. Always make sure you do plus shipping when it comes to cast iron. Super heavy. It's a little cornbread thing with cacti on it. Did you see it right here? C15, we got Mario win for $14.45 plus shipping. We don't sell a lot of video games. We're trying to learn. Seriously, they sell fast and they sell for good money. So we need to really brush up on, that's one thing in the new year that we want to do is brush up on video games, gold, and books and artwork. And brand new video games is the best. And brand new video games we think are the best. I can't believe this thing hasn't sold yet. You ever come across something where you think, man, I can't believe this hasn't sold yet? This is one of those items. Um, winner, winner, chicken dinner. Somebody's getting a brand new Dexter. It's a good brand name. Hopefully this is going to be an excellent stocking stuck for, stuffer for somebody. <laughs> excellent stocking stuffer for somebody. And it went for $8 plus shipping. We picked this up for a dollar at the thrift store. After 23,000 hours, we finally found this <laughs> tiny little sterling silver cross going out to Justin. Thank you so much again for your purchase. So we had these at home. This is a Oh Brother Where Art Thou CD and it, we sold it for $2. So we sold this Sorrel jacket. It sold for $38. And we picked that up at a yard sale like almost a year ago. I was thinking that Sorrel would actually sell a lot faster because Sorrel is a good brand name. It has this right here and it's super heavy like you said. How much do you think that weighs? Like, Five pounds, six pounds. Yeah, it's pretty heavy. Super heavy, but not bad. So thank you for tuning in to the Flip Squad. I'm Kayla. This is Julian. And we'll see you next time.